for watching Chili Boy Productions. I'm Larry Chili Boy Chilson, and this is my review for The Menu. Now, before we get into this review, make sure to go ahead and click that subscribe button down below so that you can chill with me on each and every one of my latest videos. The Menu is a 2022 horror comedy directed by Mark Malode, starring Anya Taylor-Joy, Ralph Fiennes, and Nicholas Holt. The film follows a young couple as they visit Hawthorne Island for a fine dining, once-in-a-lifetime experience, paired by celebrity chef Julian. So, when the wealthy guests all arrive, our chef has some shocking menu items in store. So, I loved the trailer for the menu. Definitely caught my attention and had me really excited to check this film out. It looked kind of like a high-concept horror, thriller-ish film to me. I love Anya Taylor-Joy. So, this was one of my most anticipated films for the remainder of 2022. Thankfully, it did not disappoint because I had a blast with the menu. So let's go ahead and kick off with our positives first. I love this script. That was the biggest positive for me was the screenplay, which was written by Will Tracy and Seth Rice. It is a dark comedy with tinges of horror type of aspects but really this is squarely in the dark comedy realm which i actually wasn't anticipating and i laughed pretty much consistently throughout the film leans into the absurdity to draw its comedy out and it uses all of that as this kind of biting commentary on social class and elitism taking direct aim at the elitism within the food, fine dining culture. Honestly, though, you can kind of apply that to any of the arts and how we view criticism, reviews, the whole lot of it. And I found it to be really funny and really effective throughout. It's a sharp, really well-written, smart script that gets its point across crystal clear and in entertaining fashion. What more could you ask for? I did also really enjoy the direction of the film. Mark Malode really captures the food photography so well, and it looks gorgeous, but this sense of eeriness throughout the entirety of the film works really well. The film builds upon itself. It does have kind of a slow start setting us up in the most outrageous dining experience you can imagine. It slowly starts piecing together the bits that make up the larger mystery at play here. All while leaning into that absurdity that makes the dark comedy work so well. I was thoroughly entertained the entire time watching the menu. The performances are really strong. Ray Fiennes is the standout. He's amazing in this film. I loved his performance. Anya Taylor-Joy is also fantastic. And then Nicholas Holt is unhinged in the best possible way here. Honestly, our cast is great. Everybody knows the role they're here to play. They understand the assignment of the film, and they all deliver it. Then... What doesn't work so well when it comes to the menu? Well, I actually think the hints of backstory play a bit of a disservice to the film. Because honestly, it exposes that we could go so much deeper with everything here. As it is, the social commentary is pretty singular in its focus. And when we leave it at that singularity, it works really well. It's fun. It's not too deep to jump into, but deep enough that it makes its point. However, we get just tiny glimpses of backstory with a couple of the characters, not many. And that's a bit disappointing, honestly. And as I said, the commentary is effective, though it definitely could go deeper. It definitely could even hit a bit harder. 
Not to say I didn't like what I got, but simply to point out that while it does bite, it doesn't quite deliver the fatality. Overall, I loved the menu. I had so much fun with this. I thought it was funny. I thought it was entertaining. And it worked really well for that message it was sending. It's absurd. It's gruesome. It's pretty much everything I was hoping for heading into the film, plus a little bit extra. So if you enjoyed the trailers for the menu, I definitely say give this a full price ticket. It delivers on that premise it shows in the trailer. So that is my review for the menu. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead, click like down below and subscribe to the channel so that you are always up to date on all of my latest videos. Also, join in on the discussion. Are you excited to see the menu? Have you already checked it out? Let me know your thoughts either in the comment section down below or you can hit me up on Twitter. I love you all so much for your continued support. Mwah. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.